The theories I will share today in this video are not my original and are taken from different places on the internet. This theory will blow your mind away because it is legit and seems very plausible. The scream of the fallen girl will come after the final winner will be announced. There is proof for it. When a guy, maybe it's a security guy, rushes to the room and tells everyone about someone who died, Chan Seo Jin is standing on the side of the piano and she is not on the white pedestal. That means she has already announced the winner. The winner announced will be Bay Rona. Then everyone will be waiting for Bay Rona to come to collect the award, but she will not come. The proof that it's Bay Rona is because in the audience we can see Ha Yoon Chul and Oh Yoon standing. Maybe because they were standing to applaud for Bay Rona or looking where she is. The third person standing with them is Kang Ma Ri, as Oh Yoon Hee and Kang Ma Ri have become friends now. So, according to this theory, the girl that falls will not die just because of falling, but it will be after falling that someone will stab her head with the trophy wing. That's why there's so much blood, because someone will fight with the girl. The girl is definitely Bay Rona. I analyzed everything, and each and everything points at Bay Rona. The dress, the necklace. The hair. So, it's Bay Rona. The writer of the penthouse wanted us all to focus on the girl that falls, but the actual twist is not who is the girl that falls. But what if the twist was something else, so that when it is revealed everyone is shocked? According to this theory, when Bay Rona will fall from the stairs and try to be murdered by someone, she will go in critical condition. She will lose a lot of blood, and will need an immediate blood transfusion. But her blood type will be unique and she will need the blood of a relative. That's when Ha Yoon Chul's blood will work, and it will be revealed that Ha Yoon Chul was the birth father of Bay Rona. The proof for this is in season 1, when Oh Yoon Hee's mother-in-law is shown in one episode, where she's protesting outside Hira Palace and bad-mouthing Oh Yoon Hee. Oh Yoon Hee snaps and in anger says, You never cared for Bay Rona, and never bought toys for her. Why the mother-in-law hated her granddaughter? It's because the mother-in-law knew that Bay Rona is not the daughter of his son. By episode 5 or episode 6 end, the butterfly tattoo woman will finally make her entry, and it's most likely to be the actress Lee ji who played the role of Shim Su Rayon. The butterfly tattoo woman is the birth mother of Seek Kyung and Seek Hoon. She will come back with a revenge plan of her own. A lot of people think that the butterfly woman will play a strong role as a ruthless woman, and her nature will be complete opposite of the sweet nature of Shim Su Rayon. Thank you so much for watching Drama Family. Take care and I'll see you again with another video. Bye-bye.